The use of deadly force or an officer doing his job. They were holding me down saying stop resisting, stop resisting and I'm screaming back and I'm pleading I'm not resisting. Dash cam video captured the precise moment. This is when Cody Blankenship says a line was crossed. He'd been fishing off of someone's private dock that morning. The police were called. He ran and ran. This is what he told investigators. I did my best to roll my face over to the other side, the right side of my face to the ground. And I see the, he's holding the baton and he grabs it by the butt of the baton and he's ramming it into my eye. The county's top prosecutor investigated. His finding, Officer Kevin Jacko used deadly force. Or did he? What you see on the videotape is something that doesn't seem to chime in with what my client, Kevin Jacko, has been charged with. This seems to be an arrest where a suspect's trying to get away, where he's struggling with the police officers, and the officers are trying to subdue him. And as you can see in the videotape, it takes several officers to take Mr. Blankenship uh, in control. Cody Blankenship has a history of trouble, a drug past. He may have trespassed, but this. I couldn't move because they were holding me down. There was no way for me to move anything. They just continued to, to hit me until they decided to stop, I guess. Serious allegations, two very different stories. As this plays out, Kevin Jacko was away from the department until a judge or a jury decides his guilt. As for Cody Blankenship, He's serving time for a series of charges. He'll be released before the holidays. Alex Sands, WPTV News Channel 5.